Hello friends, welcome to C programming video tutorial series. From the past few video tutorials, we are trying to understand tokens of C programming language. We understood that smallest unit of any programming language is called as a token. In the previous video tutorial, we discussed comments in C programming language. We understood that comments are used to explain the code logic. Comments are used to increase the readability and understandability of the code. Comments are used for the documentation purpose. Sometimes if we want to disable the execution of a part of a code, we take help of comments. In this video tutorial, I would like to discuss the next topic that is keywords in C language. What are keywords? Keywords are reserved words. They are reserved for some purpose. We cannot use keywords for some other purpose. Keywords meaning and purpose is already defined within the C compiler. For every keyword, there is a purpose and the meaning in the C compiler. For example, const, volatile, static, auto, extern, register, we use them while creating variables. To execute some set of statements based on the condition, we use if, else, switch case. To execute some set of statements repeatedly, we use for loop, while loop, do while loop. To navigate from one position to the another position, we take help of jumping statements or the navigation statements like break, continue, go to, return. While declaring variables, uh, we take help of built-in data types like char for character data type. For creating integer variable, we take help of integer data type. We take help of structure, union, enum for user-defined data type. So for every keyword, there is a meaning and purpose. We have to use those keywords for those purpose only. We cannot use the keywords for some other purpose. Keywords must be written in lowercase letters because they are defined in lowercase letters. As C programming language is a case sensitive, we must and should write always keywords in lowercase letters. Keywords should not be used as identifiers or user defined names or programmer defined names. That is, for naming variables, naming constants, naming arrays, naming functions, structures, unions, do not use keywords. We should not use keywords for naming a variable, naming a constant, naming an array, function, structure name, unions. No, we have 32 keywords in C programming language. We are going to discuss each of these keywords in detail in upcoming video tutorials. We understand the purpose of these keywords. We understand the meaning of these keywords. We understand when to use these keywords while programming. I hope you guys have clearly understood what are keywords. Keywords are reserved words. Their meaning and purpose is already defined in the compiler. Keywords must and should be written in lowercase letters. Keywords should not be used as user defined names, that is programmer written names. Keywords should not be a name of a variable, a constant, name of an array, name of a function, name of a structure, name of a union. Do not use keywords. Keywords must and should be written in lowercase letters and there are 32 keywords are available in the C language. So for this video tutorial, this much is enough friends. In the next video tutorial, we get more information on C programming language. For more benefits and be up to date, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to like, comment and share these videos with others so that everyone will get benefited. Keep learning, keep coding, keep sharing. Thank you guys. Thank you very much. See you in the next tutorial.